Hey guys, what's up? I'm Nil Lutra, your Savage Security Robotics Web Development Mentor. Whatever you guys call me, okay? That's all you know. Right. So, uh, it's been so long. It's been a lot of time. It's not online, it's not online, it's not online. That's good. Well, it's not that good actually. <laughs> but yeah, I was into a couple of things. So yeah. So today we will be uh, making 3D Doraemon. That's the idea, right? So as you can see, the card looks pretty cool. Okay? Must move chalega, idhar udhar karenge, sahi ho hai, but yeah, kya, sahi. Thik hai guys, so aaj hum yehi banayenge. You can move it in 3D, it looks pretty cool to me. Like bachpan mein, maybe kya tata cards ke saath. I remember, I love Doraemon, the cool gadgets and everything, Nobita, Suzuka, Jian, awesome team, like, ek dam must, right? So, that's the idea. So today we'll make something like this, pretty cool. Right, so uh, that's what we're going to make today. Okay, so I have already made a kind of boilerplate. We have all the photos we need. Nobita, Shizuka, Doraemon, Jian, and everything. Right, we got all the photos we need. So we have index HTML inside of CSS. I'll talk about everyone. Okay, कहाँ पे कैसे चाहिए, क्या चाहिए, क्यों चाहिए और क्या करना है. But ठीक है, मतलब अगर किसी को कोड चाहिए तो डिस्क्रिप्शन में मिल जाएगा. Don't have to worry about it. Okay, guys, so starting the code today, uh, we will start with HTML and we are writing HTML5. So we will have a kind of a boilerplate like this. We can have like this if you want to, or you can have like this one also. I think this one looks pretty small and good. So let's have a title to it. I would like to say it uh, 3D card. Give me a title over. Okay, I will say that it's a 3D card. Okay, I'll give it to you. I will need Styler CSS and AppJS. I mean, two things we will require. Okay. So let's quickly import that. So let's say script. Script is basically your JavaScript. So it's app.js. So let's quickly import app.js to it. So let's write src to it and let's say app.js. Right. I have to make it async and def for. So these are two. Things which I'm going to make it async and defer. Why I'm doing it? Uh, it's kind of a long topic. I mean, what a topic is this? But yeah, why do we need it? But yeah, that's something we need. Uh, we need to make it defer. So I'm not going to do that part. But yeah, that's what we need. Now coming to link. Link is basically how you're going to define your style sheet. That it's CSS. CSS. We will define it. We will use it. We will use link tag to use it. So let's call it style sheet. Right, so let's call it style sheet. Uh, let's have it here. We'll say dot slash style dot CSS. That's right. We have style sheet done, script done. So let's quickly have the HTML structure ready and let's get it done. So first of all, we need a container. Container with the topmost level hierarchy. Okay, the container is a super over. कंटेनर के अंदर हमारे पास होगा कार्ड, ठीक है। हम कार्ड का यूज़ करेंगे कंटेनर के अंदर तू एक्चुअली डिफाइन कपल ऑफ़ थिंग्स। कार्ड भी दो तरीके में डिवाइड होगा। वन विल बी कार्ड हेड, दैट्स राइट। एंड अंदर विल बी कार्ड बॉडी। टू डिफरेंट वेज़ टू डिफाइन द होल थिंग। कार्ड हेड विल हैव वन इ it will also have a title. Uh, we can say title would come after that. That would make more sense to me for now. Yeah. So let's have one title and then card head with card body, like three different structures. I think that would look pretty awesome. Yeah. Would look three different ways to divide. Karna. So yeah, cool. So it will look like this. Okay. So let's have it called title. We have card body. We have image. Image. Let's make it a class called logo to for it. Okay, we have logo, we have SRC. So what's assets? And in assets we have Doremon.png. That would be my image. We have no card body. So card body will have like three images, right? One is Nobita, Shizuka, and Jian. Like three images only. So let's quickly make that as well. Okay. Okay, let's have it first of all. Okay. All right, so image, image, and image. That's pretty much right. We have SRC. 
right in SRC we will have hmm assets that's important now quickly have set it done so I think image one should be our Suzuka according to card let's do with Jian and let's have third with Nobita that's right let's name these classes as well something right so let's name these classes something what we want to what, what should we name them I think we can name the first class as image one we can name the second class as image two and we can name the third class as image three that's right so this is going to be our basic structure let's have a look at it okay yeah so we got everything we need the, okay we are missing this doraemon over here right we need to have this doraemon as well so let's write it down so in html let's in title t1 we will write doraemon cool so we have this doraemon now okay matlab sahi done perfect bata sabko lag raha ho ki ye kya banana to ye tha right aur ye kya bana diya to photos laga di but yeah so that's the magic of CSS. Now the CSS will come into play. So I have already written the code for CSS, so I'm not writing it again, but I will just explain it to you quickly what how I'm doing it. And when I refresh it, bang! Magic, right? Done. CSS gives it magic to us. Okay, so CSS me kya hai? So first of all, uh, like I'm going not going into depth analysis what I'm doing it, but I'm just giving you basic. So background is important, which actually specify key on the background color use curry and so on. So over here I'm using background dot gif gif if whatever you call it. Okay. Uh, then transition is important. This is not important for now. I'll be using your but bad because the three defects are in the game. So actually this will create an uh, decent amount of difference. Now. Okay, now we have card body, card head, we have title, we have image. Okay, let's have this image 3. After image 2, that is just how it's supposed to be. It looks, looks better and so on. Okay, I think that's pretty much all, guys. We have card body as flex and everything, right? So that's all. Now we need to make JavaScript code. So how to actually move the things in 3D depending upon the movement of your mouse. So that's important thing. So coming to that part, what we're going to do is we are going to write this code first of all. So let's first remove this code uh, as well as this code to actually understand how it's working. So we are just writing mouse over and trying to move the card or style. So just move the card itself. So let's quickly refresh it and you can see card movement is there now right the card is moving in the roller directions where I'm going so there is a slight card movement using this mouse move from jayenge to card thoda thoda move kar hai. now coming to next up agla kya hoga usme agla humare paas hoga mouse enter right we have transition rotate and everything now we are performing these things all the, all the elements of the card har ek element ke upar hum usko perform kar rahe hain as you can see it looks pretty cool, right? Exactly the way we so want it to be. But now I just see my card ke bahar jaunga, it just stops working. Like exactly that time, it just doesn't doesn't solve the problem for us. So we have one mouse enter, right? Now we need one mouse leave. This one but I need the mouse me jane ke bar wapis sub ko zero zero pe set for them. And we refresh the page and we are good to go. See, going back to its position wherever it wants to be. Super awesome, super cool. And that's the design what we want to make, right, guys? Okay, so I think that's all for today, guys. Now you can make your own cards using Dragon Ball Z or whatever cartoon creators like this. Download the photos, put it in, and uh, make your own cards using HTML, CSS, and JavaScript. So, guys, let us know. Uh, what you want in content don't forget to like subscribe and share comment below whatever you guys need what you want me to make next whatever it is don't forget to like well I think you will like definitely but don't forget to comment below whatever you guys need so we'll come up with new content short videos every time we're coming up with super new content and awesome games well guys bye bye tata see ya 
See you next time on Coding Blocks Junior. Bye-bye.